Do you like Christmas? I sure do. I like giving presents and getting presents. I love the songs and the decorations and the cookies and the parties and the trees. And, well, I like everything about Christmas. My favorite thing about Christmas is that it's Jesus' birthday. We get presents because he received presents when he was born. Tonight's story begins about nine months before he was born. Do you remember what an angel is? An angel is a messenger from God. In the Bible, angels don't have wings. They look like ordinary people. In paintings and stained glass windows, they are given wings so we know who they are. This angel didn't have wings, but he had a name, Gabriel. God sent Gabriel to deliver an important message to a girl named Mary in a town called Nazareth in a land called Galilee. She was about 14 years old, but she was already engaged to be married to a man named Joseph. In those days, her parents would have decided who she would marry and make a legal contract promising her to the man they chose. She had probably never spoken to Joseph before because everything was decided by their families. Imagine how surprised, scared even, Mary would have been to see this angel appear. And imagine how shocked she would have been at his message. <laughs> Greetings, Mary. The Lord is with you. Don't be afraid. God loves you and is giving you a blessing. You will give birth to a baby boy and name him Jesus. He will be God's own son and he will sit on his ancestor David's throne. His kingdom will never end. Mary was very confused. How can I have a baby? she asked. I'm not married. I've never even been alone with a man. The Holy Spirit will make this possible. With God, nothing is impossible. Jesus will be called, called God's son. Mary trusted God's message given by the angel. I am God's willing servant. May everything you told me happen just as you said. And just as quickly as he appeared, the angel left her. <laughs> We've been talking all week about people being brave even when they are scared. Part of being brave means trusting God to care for us, even when things seem hopeless or overwhelming. Mary believed the angel's message from God, and it was a wonderful message, so why would she be afraid? Do you remember how we talked about Mary's parents deciding who she would marry? The world was very different 2,000 years ago. Customs were different, and in that part of the world, in that time, it was against the law to have a baby without a husband. Mary could have been arrested and even killed for expecting a baby before she was married. Remember, the angel only appeared to Mary. No one else heard the message. What if no one else believed her? At first, Joseph didn't believe the story. But then, in a dream, an angel appeared to him, and almost every time an angel appears in the Bible... The message is the same. Don't be afraid. The angel said to Joseph, Don't be afraid to take Mary as your wife. Her baby is God's son. You will name him Jesus because he will save the people from their sins. And Joseph believed God's messenger. They were married and they went to Bethlehem. And you know the rest of the story. We have Christmas because Mary and Joseph were faithful and brave. And the best gift we will ever receive is Jesus, God's Son, our Savior.